Hey guys, Bryce off here, and welcome back to Metal Gear Solid. There is a number seven over there. And I see a dead body over there as well. Well, let's go over here. What's in here? Bunch of supplies. Now, I have been screwed before by just rushing into something like this. So I'm going to crawl in in case there is a um, beam across the entranceway. I don't feel like fighting anything. They give you Nikita... Oh... Oh, shit. Shit, shit, shit. Shit. They give you Nikita stuff, so that indicates what I did uh, probably is what they intended, honestly. Alright. Is that the only trap in here? I don't know. I'm still going to crawl. I really don't trust this game. A box. Someone told me the boxes can be used for traveling, and... Would you please stop doing that, Snake? So I'm going to assume that you would hop in the back of a truck and hide in a box. You might be able to use them too, maybe even just sneaking around, I suppose. Alright, so we... Oh, that's just stuff on my lens. Alright, so there's six here. There's some stuff in there. There's Dead Sniper Wolf. I can't open seven. And over here we have another door, it looks like. Alright, another supply closet. Let's... Crawl in again. Uh, is there a gun thing in here? I don't see one. I'm going to carefully crawl my ass in here. Whoa, 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 what? Did I just pick up some... Does that mean there's mines in the floor here? Really? Oh, well, okay. Well, let's make sure we keep crawling, then. Yep, there are mines on the floor. We can't see them to save our lives. I am picking up mines just by crawling around on the floor. That is lucky as hell that I'm more... I'm all concerned about, uh... about the stinking, uh... tripwires they seem to like throwing out in the world. Is there another door six over here, too? There's a lot of stuff going on here. All right, we got more stuff here. Step inside and take a careful look. I don't see any of those stinking things. Let's crawl, though, again. Could you... How come I can't get to the corner? Oh, okay. Weird. Whatever. We're still going to crawl, just on the off chance there are, in fact, uh... Well, I guess the gun turrets would be a thing, too. I haven't seen a trap in here yet. Man, they really want you to be supplied before you go in there. Yeah, let's crawl backwards through that. That That's funny. <laughs> Alright, so we've picked up that stuff. Uh, I guess to move forward, we're going to have to... Could I actually crawl out the door? I'm just kind of going to kneel here. Alright, let's see here. Anything, anything of specialties here? No. So I wonder if I could travel by truck if I went in the, the cardboard box. That might be important later? I, I don't know. Hey, Snipey. How's it going? Take that, you damn bitch. You were mean to me. I don't like you. Probably shouldn't waste ammo. Alright. Is there one up there? I don't see one, but I'm seeing... There must be, there must be a gun up there. Is that a gun? Yeah, that's a gun. I can barely see it on my TV, though. Oh, we're going downstairs. <laughs> Alright, then. Into the blast furnace we go. This sounds unpleasant. This is a really odd angle they you start you on. Alright, looks like we have guards out there, judging by the vision stuff. Are you going to come open this door? No, oh, having radar back is a wonderful thing. And just to that point, since we have seen mines today, we should probably put our mine detector back on. 
Now we're going to have to wait these guys out. That's how you knock on walls. I knew there was a way to do it. You hold up against it and press B. Show sure you coming. Damn it! Uh oh. Crap. This ain't good. What the hell? He's got a shield. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, and there's guys waiting for me here. Let's go. Run away. Hopefully they don't follow me from area to area. I'm kind of pissed off. I was choking that dude out. That did not go well. Alright, let's try this again. I'm not happy with you, game. That's bullshit. That is total bullshit. He should have gone down immediately. Thankfully, leaving the area does reset it, so that's something. Ah, shoot. I had a chance to blast him. I'm gonna wait till he walks down this hallway and see if I can uh, shoot him in the back here. You're asleep. Go to sleep. Now, what is showing vision over there? Huh. This place is weirding me out a little. Oh, there is something going on over there? There is like a gun of some sort, but I can't see it. That doesn't appear to be it. No, that just seems to be moving. That's random. It's because I shot it, it moved? I have no idea what's going on here. Is this guy ever going to wake up? He seems to be pretty... There's stuff down there, it looks like. See ammo there. See, now I'm all paranoid. How am I supposed to get out of that? It looks like a box of ammo of some sort. Oh, there's a rat right there. Hi, rat. snake and I am, can flip off missiles but the second I touch a thing sticking out of a wall my bowler hat just keeps walking and I fall off into molten steel <laughs> that's so stupid okay I can sneak under it I actually have to physically control that otherwise he goes down like a freaking clown that is uh that's a thing uh, there was another guard in the room. See the guy sleeping down and like right down there. I shot him from a distance to put him asleep, so he's out at the moment. I don't see anything that's looking too dangerous just at this moment. Hmm. Uh, that looks like maybe a gun of some sort. I don't know. I don't like this place. A lot of heat. It's making everything pretty wavery. Yeah, I'll take some SOCOM, sure. Alright. Give me stuff. Give me stuff. There we go. Didn't really need it, but alright. Okay, I gotta be careful down here, obviously. I don't want to go rolling really... Wait. Can I walk here? Okay, there is a rail there. Good. 
All right. Do I need to heal? Well, we may as well check. Yeah. Anything else over here? Uh, there's some ammo that we don't need. They're really going out of the way to give me a lot of ammo. I'm assuming... What is this thing over here? There's a couple... Well, that's more ammo boxes. That's all there is. Uh-oh. Guard is awake. Is that something else I'm seeing? Maybe I've dallied too long? No, nah, there's a gun down there. Let me guess. I can't, uh... I can't, uh, take that out with that gun. I gotta actually... Get it with the SOCOM. Yeah, apparently shooting it with tranquilizer bullets isn't enough to disable it. That's... Sort of annoying. Well, I disabled that. That's something. Hmm. There's another... Looks like an elevator here. Some C4. What over here? Sorry, this is taking a while. I'm very curious as to what's going on here. Another ration. Yeah, I'm definitely playing on easy. <laughs> At this point, it's just a given this is what's happening. That looks like steam. Probably not going to be good for me to touch that. Alright, I probably rolled almost too far there. Oh, steak. Damn it. Yeah, the steam does hurt. I was kind of figuring it was. Is there a gun in here? Because I'm still seeing a bit of a scanning going on in my... Yeah, there is. Where is it, is the question. No, I'm against the wall. Screw you, game. It's right here in the corner, so it's really hard to see. All right, then. Ooh, what is this? I'm assuming that's body armor. Mm-hmm. Yes, um. You know what? I need to kill this thing. Let's just get out of here. All right. So not my most ideal. Oh, that was dumb. Not my best showing by any means. There was another ration over here, right? Yeah, there was. All right. Put that body armor on. Which way do we want to go here? Do we want to go in there? Uh, hello? What's in here? This is something that kills me. I'm going to be super mad. It's a cargo elevator. All right. It's a big ass. I know, it, I know it's a cargo elevator, but my god, that's big. Anything going on in here? Uh, doesn't look like there's anything going on in here. There's a ramp. That just leads to there. More ammo. Yeah, I'm pretty full up on ammo. They've done a good job of making sure I've got ammo. And again, I'm sure it's really limited on the harder difficulties, but you know me. I guess I actually have to trigger the elevator. Is that the idea? Alright. Let's see how that turns out for me. Probably not well. <laughs> oh, cool. He's wearing the body armor, too. Nice. Good attention to detail. Uh-oh. 
Uh, you may want to run, Snake. Not that you have anywhere to run. That was pretty badass, not gonna lie. You should just shoot him now, guys. No one will tell you to do your job, but just shoot him. Okay. Let's see. Could I try a stun grenade? Alright. Now that that's down, let's get that out. That didn't work. That didn't work. It actually stunned them. It uh, yeah, that actually went way better than I suspected it would. Is that it? You guys are going to hit me with anything else? I would say that that I'd say that qualifies as a mini boss, but not really. God, the guys with camouflage had a a better setup than that. Damn it. There we go. Thankfully the guns don't auto repair, because I take way too long. Maybe they, again, maybe they do in higher difficulties, I don't know. This going to be another running battle with these guys. It looks like I'm going to have to do another round of this. Damn it. I want to get a few SOCOM bullets back, thanks. Oh, well, let's do it. Probably the same damn thing. Oh, oh, uh oh. No, no, no. Shit. That means Vulcan Ravens around somewhere. Oh, we got a forced conversation. Snake, I've got something to tell you about Naomi Hunter. What about her? Is this conversation secure? Don't worry. It's in my head. Off. Okay. What's up? I was in the FBI too, you know. I didn't know that. What's your point? Dr. Hunter's story about her background about her grandfather being an assistant secretary to Hoover in the FBI. Yeah. And then going undercover to investigate the Mafia in New York. Yeah, what about it? It was all a big lie. What did you say? It was really bothering me. Why would she lie about it? She lied? She might be a spy. Ridiculous. Come on. Even a high school student could see past it. Didn't Naomi say that her father was Japanese? Yeah. At the time when Edgar Hoover was head of the FBI, there wasn't a single Asian investigator. Also, in the 50s, the undercover mafia sting operations hadn't even started yet. They first started in 1960, in Chicago, not New York. But you better check it out. The chief and the president mysteriously dying. That ninja. Too many strange things are happening. Are you saying that Naomi might be behind it? I don't know. Either that, or she's working with the terrorists. Could it be? Metal if I Gear. If out anything, I'll call. In the meantime, be careful. Do you want to tell me about ravens and how they probably shouldn't be here? <laughs> probably shouldn't have done that. <laughs> oh, that was great. <laughs> I think I took damage for that. Yeah, I think I did. <laughs> oh god. Only this game would punish you for shooting a raven. C4, Nikita's... What else we got? You know what? Just because I suspect we're about to run into, uh... Buttfucker McGee, as I like to call him. That's not actually his name, but, you know. Since we're going to run into Vulcan Raven here, we may want to get ourselves 
all jacked up here. A lot of Nikita ammo. Oh, good. Foggy. Yeah, we're going into a boss battle. Concern it. A lot of crows coming for your ass. Crows and ravens. Welcome, Cossack. <laughs> what? Oh my god. It's a hyper minigun. <laughs> This thing is right, not friends. not running out of ammo. They're becoming excited. Do they thirst for my blood? How dare you kill my friends? Ravens aren't scavengers like most people think. They're simply returning to the natural world, that which is no longer needed. Sometimes they even attack wounded foxes. You were the one in the M1 tank. Must have been a tight fit for a big boy like you. <laughs> but that was no true battle. It was my easily my worst battle. <laughs> Hopefully this guy God, this is gonna be painful. The Ravens and I were testing to see what kind of man you were. The judgment is decided. The ravens say you are a true warrior. I like birds. Am I hallucinating? <laughs> you are. I like birds and all that. I, I can't move. But this is ridiculous. The raven has put the mark of death upon you. That sucks. Blood from the east flows within your veins. Ah, uh, your ancestors too were raised on the barren plains of Mongolia. Inuit and Japanese are cousins to each other. We share many ancestors, you and I. Wait, he's Japanese? There's no crows in my family tree. Oh, burn! I think. You ready? I am not fond of snakes, but you are family, so I cannot complain. But there will be no holding back. Holy God. <laughs> this is gonna get ugly. For me. I gotta be make sure to- You live in Alaska, too. You know of the World Eskimo Indian Olympics. <laughs> what? With that strength. You must have been training in the stick pull and four-man carry. Yes, you are right. But there is another event that I excel at. It is called the ear pull. It's an event where two opponents pull each other's ears while enduring the harsh cold. Mm. It tests spiritual as well as physical strength. You want to pull each other's ears? The form is different, but the spirit is the same. Rejoice, Snake! Ours will be a glorious battle. This isn't glorious. It's just plain killing. Violence isn't a sport. Uh, NFL? Well, we will see if there is iron in your words. Whoa, Snake, you may want to get out of the way of that. Wait, did he bazooka block it? Or stingray block it? Holy crap. You may want to move, Snake.
Wait, so, oh, it's a mini gun. The shots are going to go right through these crates like they're paper. Here's the problem with a, a missile like that. That can get shredded by a minigun. <laughs> You're gonna pull that out? <laughs> Your little soakum? Ready! Fight! Alright. Claymores. I could use them, but I'd have to remember where they are. There's the stinger, which allows me to hit them pretty hard, I'm suspecting. Grenades might be useful. I don't want to use the sniper rifle, but that assault will probably be my main regular weapon. Well, that was a good throw. Okay, I did get him with that grenade, good. So I can probably use grenades and just keep on the run. Oh crap! No, not the way to roll! more interested in chasing me now. That's not a good, good spot to hide. Alright. It appears I'm going to have to be a little more aggressive now in my approach. Gotta be careful he doesn't get me here. Uh-oh. Alright, I'm going to have to change the plan. Um, C4 maybe? Yeah, this will work. Oh crap! I don't like his breathing here. It's kind of labored and disgusting. Missed him. Oh, oh that was... Pretty last second. I can't see him as the problem. I 
missed that one over here. Where was it, though? Oh. Uh, missed him. Darn it. I couldn't remember where it was anymore. Whoa. Okay. I didn't have the body armor on the whole time, did I? Come get me. Alright, that worked pretty sufficiently, I'm not gonna lie. Didn't want to fight him head on, my god. Hopefully that's the end of him. Just as the boss said, it is my existence which is no longer needed in this world. Oh, that's not a very nice boss. But my body will not remain in this place. My spirit and my flesh will become one with the ravens. Kind of gross. In that way, I will return to Mother Earth who bore me. You bore me. Burn. Snake! I will be watching you. Understand? Snake, take this security card. It will open that door. Sweet, got a level 7 card. I'm assuming it's level 7. I like how he still has his weapon. He can still kill me right now. Why? You are a snake, which was not created by nature. You and the boss, you are from another world. A world that I do not wish to know. Quit a boy. Go and do battle with him. I will be watching from above. First, I'll give you a hint. The man you saw die before your eyes. That was not the DARPA chief. Huh? It was Decoy Octopus. A member of Foxhound. That would explain how the chief was like rotted and destroyed. In the cell, I guess, if you've been dead for a long time. He was a master of disguise. He copied his subjects down to the blood. So he drained the chief's blood and took it into himself. That's really gross. But he wasn't able to deceive the angel of death. The Angel of Death. But why go to so much trouble? Why impersonate the Chief? <laughs> that is the end of my hint. You must solve the rest of the riddle yourself. Looks like it's dinner time. Mm -mm -mm. Snake. In the natural world, there is no such thing as boundless slaughter. There is always an end to it, but you are different. What are you trying to say? 
The path you walk on has no end. No matter how far you go, or how many corpses you crawl over, the killing will never end. That's it's a future without hope. The future is not set, Sonny Bucko. Terminator 2 taught us that. Hear me, Snake! My spirit will be watching you. Of course, Terminator 3 taught us that the future is set. And did they eat all of him? I'm curious if he shows up in a future game. Not curious enough to actually play any future games, but curious enough to, like, read a wiki or something after I'm done, I suppose. Oh, hell, he might show up in this game, but I think that's pretty sufficient. That's probably the tail end of, uh... Vulcan Raven. Snake, it's me. Master? It's about Naomi. Turn your monitor off. What about Naomi? Damn. Colonel, is Naomi there? No, she's away. She's taking a short nap. Mm. So what is this about Naomi? Okay, maybe we'd better let the Colonel hear this too. Yeah, go on, Master. Well, basically, Dr. Naomi Hunter is not Dr. Naomi Hunter at all. What? I thought her story of her background sounded kind of fishy, so I checked it out. And? There is an actual Dr. Naomi Hunter, or I should say, there was one. But she's not the woman we know. The real Naomi Hunter disappeared somewhere in the Middle East. Our Naomi must have somehow obtained her identification papers. So then who is she really? She must be some kind of spy. A spy? Yes. Maybe she's been sent to sabotage this operation. Are you saying she's with the terrorists? I don't want to believe it either, but she is working for Foxhound. So, you think she had a part in the uprising? Or she could be working with some different group altogether. A different group? It couldn't be. Place her under arrest, Colonel. What? She's betrayed us, Colonel. She needs to be arrested and interrogated to find out who she's with. If she's one of their spies, then we're in big trouble. What do you mean? Oh, nothing. The Colonel, have you let her in on some kind of vital secret or something? Does this have anything to do with the mysterious deaths of the DARPA chief and the arms tech president? I... I have no idea. Anyway, we cannot <laughs> allow her to participate any further in this mission. Wait. Wait a minute. Without her, we can't complete this mission. I knew it. You're hiding something. Give me some time. I'll try to get it out of her. Hurry, then. We've got to figure out who she is and what she's doing here. I understand. Snake, give me some time. I don't have any time left for you. Well... I get the distinct feeling. I I don't get why they're trust. I know he he helped train them at some point in the past, but he's not in the military any more than uh, than Snake is at this point. So why they're taking his word about anything is very suspect to me. There's there's definitely something weird going on here. But what did I just pick up? I picked up some dog tags, alright. Is that something you can do in... Alright, I think you can collect dog tags or something from all the different soldiers. If you kill them without raising an alarm or whatever, you like sneak up and I think you can break their neck and take their their dog tags. But I think you have to fight that. I don't know, I understand how it works. Anyway, I am going to... We're going to call Deep Throat. Maybe Deep Throat's got some info! Yeah, I'm not surprisingly. Deep Throat's been pretty quiet lately. Try Natasha? Maybe she'll have something to say. You found the body armor. <laughs> the armor is constructed of a special useful. <laughs> fiber, five times stronger than steel. Wearing that will considerably reduce damage from enemy fire. Excellent. It is designed to prevent bullets from penetrating, but you will still feel the impact from the bullets. Don't rely on it too much. That's not in the plans. All right, well, let's save it and call it a, a day for today. Um... Really, we have more questions than answers Naomi at this point. Naomi wasn't acting strangely or anything? No. I, 
I just can't believe that Naomi's an enemy spy. I refuse to accept that. Uh, I don't want to believe it either, but... Don't say it, Snake. <laughs> yeah, don't say it, Snake. All right, guys. Join us next time. We will continue on with and see if we can get some answers to these questions. But I think they're being way too trusting of the Master guy there. Besides, my Doctor Who sense to say never trust someone named the Master.